Welcome friends, it's Animal Revan here and today we've got a bit of an interesting story for you. Um, by request, uh, one of my viewers had asked me, what is this lovely, you know, application i got on the bottom here? That, my friends, is Noah Board. This is a free-to-play um, application and it's free to use for your stream and everything that you can do, use it for. Very handy and I do recommend it for quite well. Um, so I'll break this down to you what it is and where to get it. So I did a bit of Googling research and it's actually, you can find it, the application through Google into a place called OBS Open Broadcast Software. Uh, it was the homepage for OBS Project and you can see the NOAA board version 1.30 is actually available here. This application is free to download. It's easy, very comfortable to use and I will guide you through it on how to set it up for yourself. So as you can see here, um, pretty much the, when you go ahead and click on the download function like so, uh, it actually brings up to the Corona update. So with the Corona update, um, as you can see, there's a file to be downloaded. So go ahead and download it. And then you open the folder and you see the file, it's a zip file that's located okay here. So just quickly refresh it and go extract it using 7-zip. And as you double click it over here, you can see the application has been extracted. And under the subfolders here, there's a whole bunch of, you know, keyboard settings and stuff like that. Double click on the normal board application and it will appear like this. When you right click on the application in the middle of the blue screen, you can go ahead and click on settings to check the sensitivity and see whatever it is i would leave it by default and click cancel in this case go load keyboard and now it takes a while to find the keyboard that you want so when i go normal um, i basically just scroll your way through and as you can see that the screen changes as you go through and it is actually pretty straightforward um but yeah, it's actually not bad. There's a there's a lot of uh, clear opportunities here for you to look through. Um, as you can see, there's a different um, colored interfaces. Normal. Uh, there's a this is the one the one I use, which is the clean black and clean white. So let's uh, just you know show you the difference. So I'm going to go with the normal uh, black, uh, normal white, and I click close. So that's what the keyboard looks like, okay? And now the fun part is actually getting on OBS to work on this. So bear with me one second, I'll show you that in a second here. All right, so this is OBS Studio. As you know, the program that we use and enjoy, and this program is very easy to, uh, you know, to put together. So if I was going to put the uh, no board application here. So first of all, what I need to do is that I need to open a window capture. And then what I need to do is open as no board. And then take it from there. So what I'm going to do is called no board two. So for this example, so you understand. And then what you're looking for is obviously knowable.exe um, from the list. You click on that and uh, click OK. And then that's what it is. However, with that being said, though, you need to right click and go to filters. Make sure you add in the filters and go to chroma key, which is located here. Just click on OK to add, close that, leave it by default. And there you go. There is your actual application. And that you can use and ta-da you have yourself a keyboard that is running around and look at that see <laughs> that's how it works very straightforward very simple program um, yeah so just to recap uh, what you need to do is that you need to go back to OBS studio and make sure you open it as a add it as a window capture and then you call it whatever you want 
and then we take it from there. So what I'll do is I'll call it no board three, just for the sake of it. Get the source. The capture method can be automatic, just so I can give you a heads up. And also it can be defaulted as Windows 10, 1903 and up, if you wish. Capture the cursor is not uh, needed, so let's just show one without the capture cursor. And then put it aside. Right click on the filters. Get the chroma key. Apply it. Click OK. Move the OBS, obviously, from the screen I have here. But here it is, you know, the actual application up and running with all the keys. You know working as well too so there you go folks that is a pretty simple uh, useful tutorial for how to use noah board i hope you like it because i did it's a quick and sa uh, simple tool but yeah if you have any troubles just let us know and um yeah be sure to get back into it but i'll definitely show you again where the keyboard is located so go to low keyboard under the uh, J O A O some Y T, look for black normal, normal white, and there's a razor black widow keyboard and all that. So there you go, friends. Hope you enjoyed it. That's actually a pretty straightforward uh, setup there, but yeah, enjoy. Have a good one.